as a member of the congregation, as a human being. My life has been so blessed. As a Sister of St. Agnes, I have had so many opportunities in my life. I was a nurse and I loved it. I wouldn't have ever wanted to do anything different. And somehow or other, watching the sisters and watching them, the work they were doing, the call probably was always there, but I paid attention to it. I've had the opportunity to go to Puerto Rico, Haiti, Venezuela, Nicaragua, Vietnam. I mean, where else would you get such an expansive experience? I was out in Hayes, Kansas, and just loved what I was doing, and then I was asked to come back and work in the role of sponsors, and then I was elected to leadership. I like the big picture. I like to see things move forward. I believe my call within Catholic healthcare has been to help develop lay leadership. If you enjoy leadership, it shows, and you can be drawn to the right places at the right time. My spirituality, obviously, is to be of service to others, but to do it in collaboration with others. The Holy Cross Sisters, the Mercy Sisters, the Franciscans, the Dominicans, I've worked with all of them, and our common goal for the reign of God is what holds us together and what this ministry is all about. It's about the work of women religious. It's about the work that we've done over the years throughout the world. It isn't so much what you do, it's how you do it. And I never, ever had a ministry that I didn't fully engage in. God does so many strange things in my life that I just let it go and say, okay, what's gonna be next? There is nothing about my life that I would change. I have been very blessed.